My name is Jamie Dew. I am married to Kevin Dew. We have three children, Lydia, Katie, and Hayden. We started coming to BAC back in about April of 2012. We decided we needed a change and we started looking for a church and we came here and we really liked the message, we loved the sermon. Um, the people were so friendly. I couldn't believe how friendly everybody was. Like when you're coming in, it was just like they knew you forever and it was, it was just a warm feeling. Um, but we would come right at the beginning of service and we would sneak out right at the end because we were not ready to be involved. But over the summer, the Lord had really started dealing with us about getting connected and I was not sure how to go about getting involved in the church at all because we were so new and even though people were friendly, I just wasn't sure I really wanted to put myself out there yet. And once or a Sunday after church, um, Josh and Emily Dyer had stopped us and we ended up talking and talked for what seemed like hours and they had told us about small groups and we weren't sure, we you know thought it sounded really good. We went home and talked about it and then the next week they were talking about it in church. So we got out the pamphlet and we decided we were going to join Josh and Emily's group because we knew that it was mostly young families in that group. And we ended up loving it. We've met new people, we feel connected. Even just going to the small group and meeting a few other families made it easier for us to go to the young family events because we didn't feel like strangers walking in. We felt like we at least had a few friendly faces. And so it's just through that one connection of small groups, it's made us more connected even with young families and our kids love everything. They look forward to it and they've actually been driving us nuts asking when it's gonna start again. They can't wait for small groups to start again because they, it's a way for them to connect too because they're getting to meet other kids. We've never been part of a church that offered a small group. Um, I guess the closest thing to what I would consider a small group for us was like our Wednesday night service. And at that, it still, it wasn't, you didn't interact. Even like the Sunday school classes we were a part of, it was like somebody taught, we all listened. With this, we got to interact. I was afraid going in because I did not know what to expect. I didn't know if people would accept me. Everybody has this history of already being together. And here I'm the new person in. But you know what, everybody, with, after the first week we were in love with everybody. We just thought everybody was wonderful and couldn't believe how we felt like we had been part of the group longer than just the first class. We enjoy it and we like fellowship and we like, like the devotion. I would probably say to somebody who is not really sure if they want to be involved, take the leap. It's worth it. Worst case scenario, if you don't like it, you do it for a semester. If you don't like it, but you're going to love it. It's a great way to make new friends, meet new people. I walked out of my small groups with a new perspective on the sermon, which I was in a sermon-based small group. And you get to know other people's fears. You, you find out you're not alone. And it's just a way to get connected. And for me, I have to be involved to feel like I'm a part of something.